Hello, Overwatch Ali here. So I've got a quick unboxing we're going to do today. It's the Goliath, um, the Goliath Extended Chroma. Um, I used to have this razor. I forget what it's called. I'll put it here in the description. It's the old hard one, and uh, it's cool. It's RGB. It's a good mouse pad. It's just too small. So I had to go for the Extended Chroma one, which is way bigger. And uh, so I've already actually unboxed it. I did it yesterday. I just wasn't happy with my intro so here's the new one and uh yeah so let's get right into it let's unbox this and then i'll give you guys a view of what you might get out of the box and uh yeah let's get into it oh and let's do the worst coffee b-roll ever because i need my coffee let's do it So let's get right into it. Here we are. We've got our Goliath Extended Chroma. As you can see, it's got the Razor Chroma. It's the mercury color, and it's the oversized soft gaming mouse mat. Let's pop the seal on that. As you can see, it has not been popped yet, which is super exciting. Probably should be using an X-Acto knife, but you know what? Who cares? And for purposes of selling stuff. So here we go. So right out of the box, this I like. Now, I wanna make a future video about this, but there's one thing that drives me absolutely nuts, and that's when you buy a cable and it's been bent. I don't know why companies do this. It's super bad, it creates insertion loss. It's really not good for the cable over long term. And when these cables are bent, what ends up happening is people just continue to bend them. Old cables, in my opinion, sorry, it's bad. Uh, I almost feel like it should be like a lot. Like they should be round like this. It's, it's absolutely insane that they even bend them. But anyways, that's just me complaining. Out of the box, we get our beautiful razor stickers. Let's pull this out. Let's unroll this bad boy. Oh, there are, there is more content in the middle. Let's see what else we got in. Okay, so this is, this is literally just to help it keep its shape. So, we have the Goliath Extended Chroma. This must be a manual book. Something of the sort. Just flip through this real fast. So, as we can see, there's already kind of some bumps, but just by very, very lightly pushing it out, I can kind of get them out. Over here, I'll show you guys. There's just ever so slightly a bump here. Um, it's hard to tell on the camera because of the focus, but I think you can kind of tell, so. But I think with time, that should go away. I'm not too, too worried about that. And, uh, but just, just off the bat like that, using my mouse, this feels absolutely amazing. The only thing that's kind of bothering me is that this mat is already dirty. I'm guessing that's just from the manufacturers, but if you look here, there's a little bit of dust on it. So the next step we're going to do now is we're going to plug this in and we're going to turn it on. But first, we need the satisfaction of... I hope it makes a little click sound. Yeah, kind of. And this is something I love about uh, Razer. Their USBs are green. And if I'm not mistaken, I think this has to be a 3.0 uh, connector. I think all their stuff these days uses 3.0 but I would have to look at the specs to confirm that. But if I remember correctly, all their tips are green like that. So maybe they have some kind of system to differentiate the difference. This I love. 
I like to keep this for cable management afterwards. Uh, if not, I like to use Velcro or sometimes tape if it's a permanent uh, cable management. Boop. All right, let's turn this on and see what we got. So this is what the RGB looks like in a darkened room. It's, uh, it's pretty cool. This is a close-up. You can kind of see there's those little fibers going around. It almost looks like those Christmas lights that go outdoor. So I'm not sure what type of like LEDs or what they're using in there, but all in all, I find it looks really nice and it's, it's an amazing addition to anyone's setup. So it gets the thumbs up from Overwatch Ollie. That's it for this video. Hope you enjoyed and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Ciao.